All right, I think this counts as my workout today. What is up, my breaking family? Sending some positive vibes in your direction. This massive box that I have sitting on my desk right here, and I'm not even pretending. This is actually legit super heavy. But this box right here, I recently found hidden in the back of my closet, and it has a ton, and I mean a ton, of Pokemon items inside of it. So let me go ahead and grab my phone so we can go ahead and take a look at it right here and then I'll start just grabbing things from the box one by one so we don't have to have the box on the table the entire time but look you do see uh you do see the tins right there uh we got plasma blast elite trainer box a bunch of random cards and look oh, that looks like base set oh it is base set yes okay oh whoa okay okay we got a lot of goodies inside of here okay so we have to go through this entire box in today's Pokemon opening. So it looks like there's old stuff and there's new stuff that was just hiding, hiding, hidden in the back of my closet. Now I have a favor to ask every single one of you. Let me know what your favorite item is out of this box that I found in the closet. Breaking family, I think it is time we go ahead and figure out what is inside this huge Pokemon box that was legit hidden in the back of my closet. I'm not even kidding when I'm saying that. It was all the way in the very, very back. So let's see what is inside. And just like a lot of you, uh, I saw some older Pokemon cards and that is what I want to see first. I might have some cards in here that I thought I lost forever. Who knows? There could be anything. There's looks like there's some packs in there too. Okay. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Okay. There, there might be, uh, I don't know, there might be dust on these at this point. We have a Metagross. Okay, so you can see right here, it's just random. I mean, obviously this right here is from Heart Gold Soul Silver era, but you can see it is just like random cards. Bayleaf, obviously more Heart Gold Soul Silver era stuff. Snubble, of course, Psyduck. Uh, Wormadom. Oh, wow, so that's some older stuff as well. Ammonite, Manetric, Probopass, Raichu. Oh, Kabutops, Fossil. Who doesn't love Fossil? Blaine's Magmar. Okay, probably not in the best of condition. Obviously, as you can see, around the border and the back of the car. Not the best of condition, but still a really unique and awesome find. Tapu, Coco. There's Dust Bunnies. Okay. We have side. Oh, there's actually um, a couple cards inside of here. Psyduck, more Psyducks, and we have Entei. Hey, we actually just had an Entei earlier this week. This exact Entei uh, in, I think, Thursday's video. Nice, I do love that Entei. And there's the card that came with it. Neo Era, goodness. I'll set that off to the side as well. I'm sure we're gonna discover more Dust Bunnies. Uh, I think those are just all energies. Oh, wait, 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 Flaffy. There we go, Flaffy and a Mary. Let's get another huge stack right here. See what all we got. Electabuzz, Squirtle. Oh, look at that Squirtle artwork. Looking up at the night sky. Vulpix, Moo Moo Milk. I remember this card from back in the day. I used to love playing this card. Geodude, Ivysaur, Poliwhirl, Myrill, another Myrill. All right, we got World Championship cards, Swablu, Erica's Bell Sprout. Okay, now we're getting to some gym stuff. Misty's Shelter, Slowbro from Fossil, Nidoran from Jungle. We got more Jungle right there. Mankey, Dark Dragonite, Breaking Family. Take a look at this right here. Dark Dragonite, and there's actually more cards in here. Is it another Dark Dragonite? Oh, it's, it's a Fossil Dragonite. What in the world? Now, I remember buying this Dragonite right here. This is the original sleeve that I bought it in. I bought this in, if I remember correctly, I bought this in 2016 at Gen Con uh, in Indianapolis, Indiana for $3. Back in 2016, four years ago uh, at Gen Con, a first edition Dark Dragonite I bought for $3. Can you believe that? That shows you how much the prices have uh, have increased since then. I think it may have a few scratches. I don't know. There's the back of the card right there. Not too bad of condition, honestly. For $3, a first edition Dark Dragonite, I am not going to complain. Now, I don't remember if I bought this one uh, that same year or not, but I do remember buying that Dark Dragonite 
And there is Fossil Dragonite. Still, to this day, my favorite Dragonite artwork. Here is some more cards. Cubone, Meowth, Mankey, Horsey. We got Krabby. Let's just go through these a little bit faster. Ooh. Uh, Zubat, Psyduck. Yes, the best Pokemon in the entire world. Um, what else we got here? Eevee's Charmander, Dark Muck, and a very... Very bent Psyduck. Oh, that Psyduck has seen better days, but we're gonna keep moving forward. We have already discovered a lot of really interesting things. First edition coughing, Meowth. So we got a lot of commons and uncommons. We are seeing some rares here and there. Abra, I love that Abra artwork. Ratata, first edition. Drowsy, Dark Rapidash, what? Dark, uh, Dark Gloom, Spiro. Got lots of Spiros there. Um, Cyndaquil, Lapras from Fossil. Now, this is non holo Whoa, wait a minute. Sorry, Lapras. Uh, I think Gengar, Gengar from Expedition, stole your spotlight, reverse holo, and that, that is in a sleeve as well. Let's take a, let's take a quick look at it real fast. Ooh, nice, nice. Okay, that's actually in really, really good condition. Reverse holo, Gengar from Expedition. Wow, okay, that might be, uh, I don't know, that might be PSA worthy. What do you think? Is this PSA worthy? It might be, I don't know. Very well could be. I'll have to take a closer look at that. You can all let me know what you think down in the comment section down below. Uh, oh, Misty. Yes, I do love that card a lot. Hollow Rare. We got, oh, Misdrevious. Promo Misdrevious. <laughs> Wait, three of them. Uh, Donfin, Blaine's Quiz 2, Koga's Zubat, Erica's Jigglypuff, Giovanni's Nidoran, we got pa uh, Sabrina's Porygon, and in Japanese as well. Going into the next stack, we have Misty's Seal. I'm gonna go through these a little bit faster. We'll try to just get to the ones that really stand out to us. Magmar, I do like that Magmar. Uh, we got Recycle, Blaine's Magmar, Got a lot of commons and uncommons, but we are discovering uh, random things here and there. Oh, Deoxys, look at that. Heart Gold, Soul Silver, Era. Aerodactyl from Fossil. Ditto from Fossil. Doug Trio from Base Set 2. Three really nice, oh, four really nice cards right in a row. Beedrill, Seismitoad. That's from, that's from Boss Monster. Uh, Rowlet, Litten, and Poplio. So as you can see, it's just such random things inside of this box. And this next one is very random. It has a super interesting story behind it. So when I first started my YouTube channel back in 2014, I wasn't able to get uh, cards professionally made with my uh, YouTube channel name on it uh, and my URL and my social media. So what I did is I took my home printer and I typed things out and I just uh, taped them. You can literally see the tape on it and I just taped it to the front of a Pokemon card and then I put a QR code on the back. Do you remember QR codes? They were hot for like a year and then uh, nobody cared about them anymore, but that's what I did. That's what I did because I couldn't afford like professional uh, professional printing, so I just made them. I, I, I took what I had and uh, I went with it. So as you can see, there's some right there. Slow King, now this has the same story as that Dark Dragonite. Uh, I bought this for $3 that same year at Gen Con in 2016. Now I bought it for $3 and then when I got home, I actually took it out of the sleeve to find out that there was two Slow Kings in it and they accidentally gave me two instead of one. And I actually got a hold of them and said, hey, you accidentally gave me two. Can I send the other one back to you? And they said, no, go ahead and keep it. It was super nice of you to want to do that anyway. So I actually got two Slow Kings for the price of $3. I mean, how insane is that? Uh, back in 2016, once again, and it's still in the same plastic as well. That is absolutely crazy. Okay, continuing onward. Oh, nice, okay. We got Weeping Bells, we got Teddy Ursas. Uh, we're gonna go through and try to find out some more superstars from this stack. Not twos, we got Oddish, we got Mareeps, and anything else, anything else? No, no, no. But I do see a Poliwag, oh, look at that. And I do love when they put the, uh, the logo right there. Unseen Forces, more code cards. Maybe those have been used. They have an X on them, I don't know. It's Furious Fist, so uh, maybe, 
Maybe you can claim those. Oh, flash fire. Nice. Uh, there, another one of my cards. Uh, Charmander. Okay. Okay. I probably could check some of the, I don't know if I saw any first editions, but probably could check some of those for being shadowless. Um, what else do we have here? Inke, Dugong, Psyduck Reverse Hollow, and Ancient Mew. Gotta love Ancient Mew, right? It's a classic. It's a staple in the Pokemon TCG uh, when it comes to nostalgia. And Pikachu, Charmander, Lickitung, oh, Misty's, uh, Misty's Duel, yes. Psyducks, more Psyducks, and Sabrina's Psychic Control with a Psyduck on it. Here is everything else that was inside of this uh, Elite Trainer box right here. We will take a look at these packs here in just a minute. I don't know, yeah, they're open, but uh, there's still cards inside of them. All right, so we do have the stickers at the very top. We got Arcanine, Pikachu, Dark Dragonair, Light Ninetales, beautiful, beautiful artwork, Blaine's Ponyta, Mime Jr., Pokemon Tower promo, Jigglypuff promo. Everybody remembers these promos, right? With the gold stamp right there. Classic Dark Gyarados with a first edition logo, or first edition stamp. Blastoise, Venusaur, Venomoth, I mean, th there's, there's some really good hidden gems inside of here. Rapidash, Ninetales, Tyranitar, are you kidding me? Gengar, Brock Sandslash, what? We got Mewtwo, Delta Species Mewtwo. Wow, okay. That's, that's really, really nice. No Removal Gem, Brock, Charity, Focus Band, Magmortor, Rapidash, Weezing, Lucario, Arceus, more Arceus, Ditto, Ditto Chew, and a Persian. And we got these keychains that were in it. Right here, we do have Gym Heroes First Edition. And it is opened. I do remember opening this pack up on the channel back in, I think, 2017. I bought this pack for $20. I remember that. I bought this pack for $20. Dollars and I thought oh my goodness. I just spent $20 on a booster pack. You'd be lucky You'd be lucky to find a first edition gym heroes for $20 now, right? Misty's polywag first edition Blaine's quiz Brock's graveler these all still appear to be pack fresh Cerulean City gym energy Misty's tentacool Blaine's Growlithe Erica's Execute, Misty's Horsey, Brock's Sandshrew, and Sabrina's Gasly. Now the Blaine, uh, where was it? Blaine's Quiz number one. That is actually the rare from the booster pack, but those are all in really, really nice condition. I think PSA is calling. PSA! We have Series 6. Let's open this. Well, I mean, that's already open, but let's see what is inside of it. We have a Baneri... And a Manaphy. Hey, nice. That is a rare, too. Well, you only get two cards inside of them. Don't forget that. But, hey, what, there's a Manaphy in it. And these were just sitting in there. I wonder if I opened this one up on the channel. I remember opening up the Gym Heroes, but not this one. And then the last two cards in here are Slow King from Tropical Island. We do have Slow King and Psyduck on the same card. And then a base set Ninetales inside of a top loader. I have no idea why it's inside of a top loader, but, hey... I'm not complaining. Breaking family, we are just getting started going into the next box. If you are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I upload four to five times every single week, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, or at least close to 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time through the week, and then on the weekends, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Make sure you also hit that notification bell. You've been on YouTube plenty of times. You know exactly how it works. I don't need to tell you, but I feel like it's habit at this point, right? Uh, okay, so I am seeing some rares. We got Chansey, Octillery. This actually might be a box full of hollow rares. It is. Look at this. An entire uh, Elite Trainer box full, full of hollow rares. Every single one of these is hollow. Oh, wow. Look at that. Let's just go. Oh, Mimikyu, Machamp, Nidoking. Oh, I wonder if... Oh, Jirachi. I wonder if maybe, uh... A Charizard is in here. Do we have an Evolutions Charizard, maybe? We already saw Chansey. We saw Nidoking as well. Blissey. Into the next... Oh, there's Charizard right there. Uh, not the Evolutions Charizard, but it's still a Charizard. Nonetheless, 
We got Walren, Blastoise. Wow. Oh, I remember those. Oh, I wish they would have stuck with those a lot longer. Those were so, so cool. Uh, Slowking. Tyranitars. Uh, what else we got here? Anything, anything? I mean, a, a lot of this is, is noteworthy, but we're looking for something that just like really, really sticks out to us. Um, not seeing a whole, oh, Absol, look at that. Oh, yes. Plasma Absol, Pyroar, and then the last stack right here. I cannot believe this is just a huge stack of hollow rares. Mimikyu, Raichu, uh, Gengar. I do love that artwork on the Gengar. I have not seen a single non-hollow rare, an entire stack of just, of just hollow rares. This was legit hiding in the back of my closet. Probably, I don't know how long, probably since what, 2017, 2018? And to the next one, we do have Plasma Blast Elite Trainer Box right there with Genesect on the side. Oh, this one's heavy. Are we, uh, do we have more hollow rares? Code cards. Is this an entire box of code cards? <laughs> this is an entire box of code cards. I have no idea if these are used code cards, but why would I keep used code cards? These have to be unused. Whoa, okay, okay. Well, I can't sit here and give you code cards all day long, but but let me give you some right here. We have Guardians Rising. We got more Guardians Rising, more Guardians Rising. Steam Siege, everybody's favorite set. Sun and Moon, Guardians Rising, Guardians Rising. Tapu Koko figure box and Phantom Forces booster. Let's see if there's anything just a little bit older. Uh, okay, that's uh, dollar dollar store stuff. Um, Tapu Koko figure box. Uh, breakthrough booster. I think maybe this is just XY stuff and then early sun and moon. Uh, Primal Clash. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Um, and then we got Fates Collide. Okay, that's enough of that. Now there is a poster inside. Oh, two posters. I believe you got this when you uh, pre-ordered Sun and Moon. And I do have two. Oh, no. I thought it was two copies. Here's the other poster right there. For the Hoenn region for Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. That's right. That's, oh, yes. And it's kind of like that, um, kind of like treasure map paper. You see that? A tin, which I do see code card on top. Is this another thing full of code cards? There is a League 2016 season to Y season. So there you go. Um, and then Roaring Skies booster. Is that more Roaring Skies? Yes. What do we got here on the side? We got Ancient Origins. And then over here, we got more Ancient Origins. So, oh, and Furious Fist. So a tin full of what I'm thinking is unused code cards. Somebody claim some of those code cards. Let me know if they are used or unused. We have a deck box that has nothing inside of it. Another deck box that has... Oh, this one actually has something inside of it. We got maybe just random things. Yeah, just random cards. I don't think anything of super importance... I do see plastic back here, so let's see what that, oh, Eevee. Marie has actually been looking for this Eevee, so now I know where it's at. Metagross, Beldum, Matang, Lugia, look at that. Classic Lugia artwork, wow. Okay, and we got Electabuzz from base set two, more Jigglypuff, another Pokemon Tower, Machamp promo, Rainbow Energy, like oh there we go Electabuzz promo, Aria does Machamp Raichu from Fossil. Is there two cards in there? No, just one. Gardevoir, Moltres, Articuno, Zapdos. We got all three right there. Wigglytuff, Alakazam from Expedition. Yes, Alakazam from Expedition Reverse Hollow. We got that Gengar from Expedition as well. Wow, that that is a beautiful beautiful card breaking family. Alakazam. Actually, not bad at all. Wow, okay. There is the back of it. Wow, okay. Alakazam Reverse Hollow from Expedition. Possibly another PSA card. Who knows? We will have to wait and find out. Magneton. We got Crobat. Gengar. <laughs> How you doing, Gengar? Hitmonchan. Latios and Latia. Celebi. Ninetales Delta Species. Now, that one's looking a little rough. A lot of scratches on that one, but I'm still going to show it some love. Rockets, Hitmonchan, 
Giovanni's Gyarados first edition. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna take that one out of the sleeve as well. Take a look at it. I do believe there is some scratches on the hollow, the hollow foil. Yeah, I believe there's a couple scratches, but that's still, that's still really nice. First edition, Giovanni's Gyarados. Then we got Magneton first edition from Fossil. Let's say, oh, I see another Magneton right over there. This is actually really, really fun. Uh, okay, Magneton, that one's in a little bit rough shape. That one's seen better days. Lieutenant Surge's Magneton right there. Let's take a look at that one as well. Uh, that one's got a couple scratches on it. Okay, okay. At least that Alakazam, though. That Alakazam was looking really, really good. RCS, more RCS, more RCS. And newer stuff. Yes, newer stuff. Uh, yep. Now, I'm probably not going to pull out everything inside of this box because some of it we don't need to go through everything because there's just like random figures inside of here. Uh, a bunch of those. And then we have a lot of these plastic... Uh, plastic containers with pins and coins inside of them. So we don't need to go through all of those. We have another deck box with Froakie on it. There is a few cards inside of there. We got Cosmog, Chestnut Break. I see our buddy Dragonite, a Fossil Dragonite, Gyarados, Yon Mega. We got Zapdos, a Molga. Oh, what did we miss there? Articuno, Gyarados, Lugia. Come on, oh, 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 Kingdra, Tapu Bulu, and Raichu Break. <laughs> yes, I remember these were in uh, mystery power boxes. I think like the mega mystery power boxes at one time. I think that's actually where this one came from. Yeah, a bunch of like scratch, scratch games, I think. Yeah, and then there was like a little coin to scratch it right there. This is from, let's see what year this is. I don't know the year off the top of my head, but there should be right over here. Okay, uh, copyright 2000. Wow, 20 years old. Another bottom of Elite Trainer box. We have more code cards. There you go, Burning Shadows. Somebody take a Burning Shadows one. Somebody else take a Burning Shadows one. And another Burning Shadows. Hopefully pull a Hyper Rare Charizard. We got energies. Everybody always loves energies, right? We got a bunch of dice. We got GX markers. Uh, train on right there. Random sleeves. More dice. And a Keldeo Battle Arena box that is completely empty. Y'all, I'm going to be honest. I am running out of space over here. Empty Gengar 10. We got little mini albums in here. I think there's a bunch of those in here. Yeah, see, there's just a bunch of random things. I don't need to pull all of that stuff out. Another Elite Trainer Box Crimson Invasion. Oh, wow. Okay, that is a lot, a lot of stuff. We got a pin. Uh, we got more pins. We got coins. All sorts of things inside of this. I think it's mostly pins and coins, though, and uh, possibly some energies. This is definitely, definitely not something we need to go through. And another... Elite Trainer Box with a bunch of cards. Yes. What do we got here? Doug Trio. Oh, those are really bent. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. We'll go through it and see what all we find. This might be newer stuff. Now, that was just the first couple cards that were bent. So, um, none of the other ones appear to be bent. Okay. This is just all Pikachus. <laughs> okay, no, the first part of it was just all Pikachus. I wonder why. Was I doing like a project or something? Uh, oh, Misty's Determination, Magmar, Machop. Okay, some older stuff mixed in with uh, newer era stuff. Another Tapu Coco. Oh, Venusaur EX and an Absol EX as well. Now we're getting into some interesting stuff. Darkrai. Zygarde, another Ditto Chew, Zygarde again, Venusaur EX, more Dark Rise. Wow, okay. Whoa, okay. Shaman? Oh, I love that Shaman artwork. Are you kidding me? Two of those. Ho oh. Ho oh break. Wow, my fat break. Wow, there's some interesting things in here. Some of these cards, I'm gonna be honest with you, I kind of forgot even existed. Alright, alright, we're rediscovering something here. Uh, more, it looks like newer stuff. Yeah, more new stuff, more new stuff. Oh, okay, that's a little bit older. There we go. We got Maxi. Uh, energies, lots of reverse hollow energies. Oh, no! Oh, 
Don't even get me started. Don't even get me started. More Oricorios. Uh, anything else interesting? Oh, nice. Mega Gardevoir EX. Jirachi. And more Hollows promos. League promos. Oh, wow. Lots of League promos right there. And, oh, Dimension Valley. Nice. Okay. Super, super playable card. And that is... Oh, Umbreon's. Umbreon's. I don't know if Marie's looking for one of those. I might need to actually keep that out. And then there is just a few more cards inside of here. We got Garchomp EX, Venusaur EX, Blastoise EX, Mega Rayquaza, Rayquaza, Rayquaza EX, Shaman EX, still in the plastic wrapper, Primal Kyogre EX, Magirna. We got a full art Mallow randomly in here, a Volcanion EX, Secret Rare is just hiding inside of this box, Mega Manetric, Zygarde EX, Mega Lucario EX, Aerodactyl Spirit Link. Oh, yes. Breaking Family. I got to tell you about this. One time, actually on several occasions, I got to meet uh, Eric Stewart, who did uh, the original voice of Brock and James uh, from Jesse and James. And I had him sign my Brock card. It's not on the plastic. It's actually on the card itself. A stack of Elite Trainer Boxes. All of them are empty, except they do have their contents, the sleeves and the dice inside of them. Random Tops card. And don't forget, a Haunter Tops card. And then the rest of what is inside of this box, there's a couple tins, uh, there's some booklets from Elite Trainer Boxes, some dies, more sleeves, and everything's falling over. But that's pretty much it. Breaking Family, that's it for today's video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out these videos right here. I'll see you all in the next video. I love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.